Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Kadelka. And on the last episode, we ran into a freaky old man in the graveyard who ended up opening a door for us. And... Yes, I want to pray in front of Charlotte's grave. I have no idea what this will do. And, uh... It does nothing. Okay. Nothing yet, anyway. Anyway, trying something else out with this particular recording. Which, uh, some of you guys may have known, may have not have known. Uh, already prayed at that grave. Come on. And back this way is that, uh, courtyard. Okay. Going back up here, going back towards Charlie's grave, but to see if there's any other way to go. Which there probably is. I know, I'm sorry for, uh, for not recording this, uh, that often. Alright, uh, they said meet him in the library, so going towards the library. This should be a nice little cutscene where everybody joins together again. Kadoka! Edward. Oh, thank goodness you're okay. Not completely the case. I have some bad news for you. I saw the caretakers, both the husband and wife. Really? Where were they? They're dead. Oh. Apparently, they weren't the ones responsible for killing all the thieves and desperados that were sneaking into the monastery. And with good reason. I don't know. I believe you should know very well what has been going on. Ogden was trying to avenge the death of Elaine. Death? Elaine? I can't believe it. This is preposterous. Who is. I have no idea. All I know is Elaine's spirit called me to this place. Tell me, who is Elaine? And Patrick. The caretakers told me that robbers broke into Elaine's home while Patrick was away and murdered her. Elaine was a benefactor for the caretakers. They took it upon themselves to murder every single robber and desperado that entered their grounds. It was a form of revenge for them. Originally from Ireland, you see. I have no idea what to think of small, that. My family had a successful business and was soon able to send me to school, which I loved from a very early age. I was accepted to a prestigious university in England. And with my parents' assistance, I made my way across the ocean. I met Patrick at university. Uh, we both studied huh. chemistry and embarking upon similar paths. About that same time, we began competing for the love of a beautiful woman, Elaine. We had a falling out. Okay. I loved Elaine with all my heart. Omnia Winston to more. But love does not conquer all. Uh -huh. I soon discovered that I lacked the social status and inherent money necessary to properly care for someone so well-bred and sheltered as Elaine. <laughs> I gave up my suit and made way for Patrick. To ease my pain, I in the church and left the secular world behind. And being the perfectionist I am, I can make me a bishop in charge of some very important matters. But it's been so hard to distance myself from one's emotional attachments. <laughs> Although I had not seen them for 20 years, 
I wish them all the best in our life together. And if it hadn't been for this, I wouldn't have thought twice about seeing Patrick again. That's right, Patrick. How, how can this be? He promised me he was going to take Elaine and make her happy. What could have happened? Being a witness to the gory aftermath. I have a hard time believing the caretakers were acting on revenge alone. Believe me, it was an unimaginably heinous sight. And what about these monsters that keep appearing? No, there's a bigger secret we have yet to uncover. This is the key to Patrick's mansion. Shall we go? Okay, so now I'm going to Patrick's Mansion, who actually had a falling out with James. Which, it turns out, I'm actually beginning to like James a little, tiny, teeny bit more than I thought I was. Even though, still don't like James. He's not a good character. I mean, he's a good character, but he's not a good character. You guys see what I mean. Anyway, last time we got the, uh, other doll, and what the heck is this? It's got green on it, and he still has that. Action, magic, green is weak to fire. Green is wind, wind is weak to fire. Yet it threw a fireball. Okay. This may not work like I thought it would. That's still dead. Desired result? Achieved. Anyway, yeah. Um, yeah, like I said, I'm sorry for not recording these more often, but uh, I will get better at it. I just haven't been uh, in the best of minds lately. <coughs> or apparently the best of health. But anyway. Well, I don't need to do this again, thankfully. Quit laughing at me. But yes, I'm going to get the green key because I have the two dolls and uh, maybe sequence breaking, but uh, I don't know. I really don't. I don't know a lot about the game, so that's why I'm going to be doing this anyway. And backtracking, backtracking. Yes, I'm sorry if it's boring or what have you. But, hey, there's that incredibly hard to find secret. Yeah. Look at you! You're ugly! 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 Going to guess, because again, green means... Weak to fire. It just took 2,000 damage. I was gonna say, 
It just took 2,000 damage and shrugged it off. But I was wrong. And I'm glad I was wrong. Because if it had taken 2,000 damage and shrugged it off, I would have not been leveling my characters right. And I would have been scared. Okay, go out this door. Yes, the underground tunnel. Um, it's amazing how this game kind of stays in the exact same place. The entire game. Uh, can I get acid yet? No, I can't. I'm probably gonna need that in Patrick's house, so... I'm gonna need to go this way. I don't want to have to backtrack, so... Okay, I just needed the green key, and I won't need the green key anymore. Yay! What's that? I found a potion. Yes, I will take the potion. It's over here. Yes, as you couldn't tell, I'm the type of person who will search just about everything in a game like this. Unless it's right in front of my eyes and looks different. I have the right to actually beat myself up over that, because I have the right. I had a feeling that it would go down like that. Tell the Tita I said. Like a bitch. Yeah, if you can't tell what I've been watching, then... For shame. Anyway, uh, after this battle, I'm gonna call it, so... We'll see you guys on the next episode of Kodelka. This is Solomon23, and some of you knew that already. Still in catchphrase for the win. Good night.